is some of the species that we are uh, working with are under constant threat. Uh, rhinoceros, uh, elephant, uh, lions, leopard, pangolin. Uh, these are all animals that, that are in the ecosystems that we're protecting and we're out there each day on, on the front lines to ensure that survival. Cattle farming is, is one of the big threats that we face, um, particularly in Africa. This is a big issue uh, on a continent that's going to have 2 billion people on it by 20, uh, 2040. E.O. Wilson, the foremost biologist um, of our time, said if, we, if we're going to stop our acceleration into the sixth mass great extinction, we need to set aside half of the planet for nature. At the moment, we've got around 17% set aside. It's a matter of finding balance um, because you know, we don't, we're not going to stamp out agriculture across the continent. But what we can do is, is try to motivate people through the programs that we do, that, the, that conservation and wilderness um, is, is worth something, it has a value, and that value is long-term. It's much more significant than, than what the value of agriculture is. And, and I think that's the key point to take away. The word endangered, uh, for me, what that means is, is, is where we're going as a civilization. Uh, we treat the one beautiful backyard that we've got, uh, nature, as a toilet, basically. If we don't start to realize that uh, we're soon going to be the endangered ones ourselves, 